I am kicking off Women's History Month with a mural, so it's a pretty powerful piece. Um, my work is about harnessing the power of vulnerability and taking risks and really understanding your trauma to live a very emotionally conscious life. I mean, I build my entire brand on social media. I come from a digital marketing background, so for me it came very naturally, but to be able to use that platform as a voice to really talk about the art behind the, the heart behind the art, right? Like it's really the core of everything that I do. And I truly believe that people don't fall in love with the art, they fall in love with the artists more so. And so being able to share the story and the works and the inspirations behind it on that scale and really extending that opportunity for viewers and you know followers to really engage with that story, it's been such a blessing. I'm Jenny Bias, I'm a local artist in Chicago and a muralist. It's a woman breaking free from the norms of society. It's just really important to me, coming from an Indian culture, that really, um, as women, we are still finding our footing. There's a two-part um, ghosted image there where there's a woman in finding serenity and freedom. And so it's a very, it's a super powerful piece. Hopefully the city's ready for it, <laughs> but I'm excited. The original work started in black and white. It's very high contrast work where I talk about a very deep singular emotion. And so I like to take away the noise quite a bit. I love your wings. So oh yeah, the wings were such a beautiful um, invite from Federale. The wings were literally a celebration, almost a destination for people who are visiting Chicago. This piece really focuses on such, a, such an important message that I really didn't want to create any other noise besides making it stand out. And there's a lot of negative space in my work, and so this piece really just lets the negative space shine as well. My last big job was heading e-commerce at Oprah, and then uh, went through a big breakup, and like great stories start from broken hearts. I decided to paint one day and go all in, and it just kind of became a story eight years later. It's been such a gift.